A new temporary home after days on the streets. Hundreds of asylum seekers checked into the new Karatepe migrant camp on the island of Lesbos over the weekend, where some 3,000 tents are being set up by the Greek army and the United Nations on a former artillery range. Nearly 13,000 migrants living on Lesbos were suddenly displaced Tuesday night when fires gutted the Moria camp, Europe's largest refugee facility. The camp, designed for only 3,000, was notorious for its poor living conditions. Many migrants still on the streets are wary of the new camp. They worry that it too could quickly become overcrowded and unsanitary. They want to transfer us to there, but I think uh, there is no good for uh, this uh, second hell and uh, second Maria. Saturday saw Greek police fire tear gas at migrants protesting against the construction of Karatepe as they demanded to be transferred to the mainland. Many local residents, weary of their island's status as a limbo for thousands of refugees, are also opposed to the new camp. Since the fire, 10 European countries have agreed to take in 400 unaccompanied minors who had been living in Moria. Aid groups say more action needs to be taken at the EU level to help all the migrants stranded on Lesbos.